listener uh, viewer might not realize is that o O'Kelly was the defense's uh, investigator. He wasn't a prosecutor. And what Brendan said, it, O'Kelly was trying to get him to confess to at, coming home at 345 and then from 345 till 10 o'clock at night, they raped and murdered her and then burned her body. Well, Brendan told him that I was at home at 5 o'clock and my mother saw me. At 5.30, I called a friend. At 6 o'clock, my brother's boss called and I answered the phone. At 7, I got another call. O'Kelly O'Kelly didn't even bat an eye. I mean, those calls can be verified. The, the brother's boss has no reason to lie and say, I called the residence and Brendan picked up. That should have changed everything in O'Kelly's mind, and it didn't. And, you know, I say this a lot. If you're an investigator, if you've got a complicated case, you will occasionally get off on the wrong road and come to a dead end. A good investigator says, crap, and, and you backtrack to the last point you knew you were right and head off in a different direction. O'Kelly got to the, the roadblock and started digging a new road.